Hey guys, thank you for watching. This is my YouTube channel, Breaking Burke. It is about houseplants and gardening here in the desert of Albuquerque, New Mexico. In today's video, I wanted to share with you uh, what I'm doing here with this propagation. Uh, it's not a propagation yet, it's still a plant. But if I pull up this piece here, you can see it is a bit leggy in spots. It was uh, tangled up pretty hard when I got it. And it did go through a decent shock. So. You can also see there is quite a bit of yellowing on the older leaves, but we do have some more, uh, some fresher new growth here that is coming out healthy and green and looking the way it should. So what I'm going to do is see if I can get a couple of these long leggy parts off. I'm just going to trim it at the last good leaf and that'll cause it to branch out from there. But you can see I have this section here, which is nice and long and it was actually hitting the floor so that's the back side where you see the red and here's the green front really cute plant and it does look similar to a uh, string of hearts and all I'm doing with these is putting them in uh, a vase I will show you at the end But nothing crazy, just in water, and uh, since it is a pepperoni, it should root pretty easily. I've tried growing it from just a leaf, and either it's not doing it or it's taking its sweet time, so I figure I will try and do some cuttings. There is someone out there that I'm doing, uh, or planning on doing a trade with. I'm going to hold this up so we can actually see what I'm doing. And you see where it goes bald here? That's where I'm going to chop. So I think she would definitely like uh, a section of this or a couple pieces if I can get them to root. I haven't told her yet because I don't want to tell her I'm trying to root this and it doesn't go well. Then I'll feel bad. So I'm just going to do a little propagation. You see this where I'm cutting it there. And all these pieces do have a bit of legginess. Like I said, it had a hard shock when I got it. And like any other propagation, if you can keep the leaves out of the water, you will have better chances and less chance of it rotting. So on something like this, how it goes uh, kind of bald for a couple nodes and then a couple leaves, I'm just going to take off those leaves. It's not really doing anybody any good there. And if I can have a couple more nodes in water to get more roots, that's even better. So I took off the petiole and everything. The petiole is the stalk that holds the leaf onto the main stem. And I'm going to stick that in water. Okay, and here's my propagation vessel. Orange because Halloween's coming. And I thought it would look good with the red back of the leaves. But nice tall vessel. You can see the stems in there. So hopefully we'll get some roots on this pretty quick. Uh, I will give an update. I'm going to do a couple more chops. But I don't think you guys want to be here for that long. Just watching scissors go at this poor plant. And you can see stuff like that. I'm probably going to take off. That will also encourage it to bush out more. Which is the whole purpose of this. Uh, I might also either throw a couple pieces in there or just take one of these that is kind of bald and wrap it around the top on the soil and hopefully that will encourage it to root and throw out more branches. Thank you for watching and have a great day. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.